Hello guys, welcome to Coding Cafe. My name is Mohammed Ali. So in the previous tutorial, we have created our this beautiful sign up page. I mean the sign up UI. Now in this tutorial, we are going to create our uh, sign in page. I mean sign in UI, and then we will connect our app to the uh, Firebase so that we can allow a user to register and sign in using the Firebase authentication. So yeah, I mean, uh, let's start working on this. So go to the Visual Studio Code, and this is our sign up page which we created in the previous tutorial. Now what I'm going to do is uh, all you're gonna need is just to copy this sign up page code. Okay, sign up.html. Copy, select all code, and then copy it, and go to the sign in page. Remove this, and paste that here. Now let's change this code for the login page. So first of all, uh, make sure to change this uh, register to login, and then uh, also let's change the images. So instead of uh, this register back, we are going to change it to slash, and we have an image by the name login back dot jpg, and then we have a side image. Which is at the center and it is by the name let's remove this sorry remove this okay and it is by the name login so yeah that's it now the next thing is we need an email field password field we do not need this confirm okay so confirm password field okay so remove this div and then we need a login button so let's say sorry login now one thing which we need uh, here is okay first of all make sure to change the id of this button specifically okay to btn login now we need to add a forget password link in case if the user forget a password so then he can reset it so for that i'm going to copy this uh, already have an account text just copy it and paste it above here w full text center let's add the other class which is p dash p dash 27 p dash b dash 239 now in here we are going to create a span tag span Class text dash muted, and I already told you guys that these are basically the classes which we are accessing for. I uh, mean, to make the text uh, beautiful. I mean, so that the UI looks more beautiful. So you can say forgot username. Username slash uh, password and when a user click on this so we will send the user to the forget password.html file and now let's add a new file now before doing that make sure to click here okay so that it can create here so just click on this new file and the name of our this file will be forget password dot html for now it is an empty page okay but later on we will work on it so anyways so forget password dot html yes it is okay and then we have uh, we have to change this to not have an account sign up that's it now let's save it save all HTTP server and let's see what we got on the screen so our app starts from the 
I mean you can start it from anywhere but anyways sign up.html let's click on I already have an account and here you can see it wow this is really incredible but the alignment of this image with these things are not that good okay I mean we have to move it little bit above or uh, yeah let's just see so all you're gonna need is uh, I mean for this we have to move it I mean let's give it alignment okay from margin top 66 so that it can move 66 percent save all let's refresh this oh so instead of that uh, we can say 21 okay because it is from the top so we have to move this little bit above so we have to give it margin from the top uh, less not in more size okay because it will go down if we increase the number that is 70 80 so we have to decrease it so we can say 21 percent from the top margin from the top and also uh, make sure to change this link to sign up dot html if a user click on it save all yeah let's check it so yeah it is now perfect and we have to move this here now we have to uh, remove margin from here okay we do not need it so that it can move automatically here and then we can switch back i mean uh, margin for it okay because here you can see we have this margin top now what we are gonna do is just uh, remove this okay this whole style and if you save it then it will basically uh, sorry here let's refresh it and here you can see it also moves here at the top now we have to give it margin proper margin from the top so we can just say here now I mean now you can say 66 will be good okay save all yeah it is now looks cool it looks cool here you can see it wow this is so incredible okay relative page so yeah I mean uh, in this tutorial we have created this uh, login page and one thing let's add a title here for the sign up and sign in page okay so just come here and this is our sign in page so we can just say login okay and for the sign up let's add a title which will be sign up that's it save all let's refresh this and here you can see it login if you click here and here you can see it sign up and you can see it I mean this is perfect this is so cool and so incredible so yeah that's it for this video and in the next video tutorial finally we are going to connect over this app to the firebase real-time database and by using the firebase authentication we will allow the user to first create an account and then sign in using the firebase authentication process so bye for now